You did hear Chill Clinton with movies before the break. Uh, Chill Clinton's playing the Casbah tomorrow. It's cheap. You should come down. Played some rug burns. The Fairies Came, a classic from back in the day. Also, uh, another one, a defunct band not around anymore, Smith's Ranch Boys with Barking Up the Wrong Tree. I have uh, Priscilla Castro here. Priscilla, how are you? I'm doing well. How are you? I'm good. How's everything over at the hideout? It's great. Yeah? Uh, Yeah, we've got some cool shows, cool DJs. It's beautiful inside with the remodel. We have a wonderful bus stop right out front. You do. You've got the rapid uh, bus stop <laughs> out there. Right. So, Is that uh, bringing a lot of clientele to the uh, hideout? Not yet, <laughs> you know. Um, but hopefully you don't have to drink and drive. You can ride the bus. How late does the bus run, though? Does it run late? I don't know. God, we need a bus system that will get us all home <laughs> safely at 2 in the morning, don't exactly. we? Exactly, with a stop at Saguaros. There you go. Well, Priscilla, you, you brought these young gentlemen from south of the border in which i was aware of but you've reached out to me and asked if they could come on we got a show for them coming up a week from tonight at the casbah but tell us a little bit about them and introduce them uh their name uh band is glassmas hi hi hello hola hola Hola. (laughs) um yeah they're super rad i booked them at the hideout uh like three weeks ago three weeks ago yeah Yeah. Um, just a, a friend referred me to them and i booked them and just fell in love with them yeah, we just clicked. It clicked. Immediately. It clicked. Yeah. It's magical. Well, you need a representation on this side of the border as well, you know? Yeah. Yeah, we've been playing in bands for a long time, but this is like our first month officially that we're really coming down here and up here and getting it. Is, oh, okay. But you've been playing shows yeah, up yeah, here a little bit. Yeah, we played like uh, House of Blues and The Griffin and a But it's like one shows. off, and then we come back after like two months, three, maybe half sure. a year. Do you borrow gear when you play up here, or are you bringing your yeah. own gear? We oh. borrow some. Okay. Borrow yeah, some. we bring, like, the basic stuff. I mean, that makes guitar. it easier for you to get across Definitely. the border, yeah. I would imagine. At least right? drums and a good bass amp and that. That's cool. Good. And you guys are playing a week from tonight with uh, another band that I just came across. Great band called Glass Spells. Yeah. yeah. Total We're about that. dance punk band. Yeah. I'm, like, really excited to see them. Of course, I will not be there because I'll be here. Yep. Uh, but I'll well, remind man. everybody to go to the show and see yeah. Glassmas, yeah. and it's going to be a good one a week from tonight at the Casbah. Um, let's play a couple songs from your album. Has this been out for a little while? Or? Yeah. We, 2012. We put it, yeah, we put it like late 2012, and we've been touring behind that, and we're ready to like... Uh, we're going to put out a new EP after that, but we're currently we're pushing still that EP, so right now it's coming kind of a, a, a couple of warm-up shows before we come back and start presenting the new stuff. Glassmus.com, G-L-A-S-M-U-S.com. What, what is the biggest influence before anybody gets to hear your music on the band? Where, where do you guys come from? Biggest uh, influence, okay. Yeah, do you have bands that inspired you to do this? Oh, definitely, oh, yeah. yeah. Definitely. Uh, I love like everything that like Radiohead do, and I think that's my biggest influence. Okay. The band name comes from a band called Tortoise. Mm-hmm. which is instrumental. Sure. They have a, a, a song called Glass Museum, so when we're looking for their band name, I kind of put together the words and, and made it up that way. So Tortoise, Godspe- uh, Godspeed You Black Emperor, a lot of post-rock stuff, that's what I'm into. Yeah. Very interesting. Oh, cool. Yeah. I like that. All right, so any shows in TJ coming up that people should adventure for and head Saturday down there? Saturday before the uh, Sunday show, actually. There's a beer fest over there. In, in, in TJ? Okay. Yeah, huge festival. Yeah. Beer and Glassmus and other uh, TJ bands? Yeah. Yeah, we're we're closing the Saturday. You're the headliners, day. sort of. Yeah. So do uh, do you guys tour down into yeah. Mexico? I yeah. mean, have you played Mexico City? And, yeah. and really? Yeah. yeah. Cool. Yeah. It's How's that? Is that is that uh, you, you you drive down there? Or no. <laughs> we, you just fly in for a yeah, show. Yeah, we lived there like uh, like six months because like all of the record industry in Mexico it's it's in Mexico City. So sure. We 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 decided to. You oh, needed to play. Yeah. Have you played Los Angeles? Yeah. We played the satellite a uh, couple of almost a year ago. Yeah, we opened All for right. like a. But it was like a Wednesday oh. at the satellite. But the, the place <laughs> it was, was really cool. cool. We loved it. Well, support these guys on Sunday a week from tonight. It's cheap, and uh, you get to see another great new band called The Glass Spells. Let's listen to this. This track is number one on the EP. It's We Are Machines. It's Glassmos on the local ninety four nine. The Local 949 with Tim Piles on FM 94.9.
Yes, Glass Moose from TJ. They want to play your house party. They just need to borrow some gear. Help <laughs> them out. If you want to book these guys, they do have to come all the way from TJ. And it's so much easier if they don't have to bring all their gear. So help them out. Come to the show on Sunday. I know for sure uh, you guys are playing the Anomaly and Glass Spells. I think maybe there's uh, another band on there as well. But Cool, yeah. Okay. Looking forward to getting you guys up here into the States a little bit more. Thank you very yeah, much. Yeah, we're looking forward to that. Thank you, we'll thank do you. the Casbah. And thanks for listening to you know me all these years. Yeah, it's crazy. I love that. I appreciate yeah, for it. Yeah, it's, it's super surreal because, I mean, obviously this is our first time over here and uh, doing, at least my first time doing any radio over here. So it's pretty surreal because we've been listening to the station for a long time. Yeah. There's something that is seriously being missed between the two cultures and just the fact that we are so close together. And there's so much magic that could be happen, happening between it's, San Diego and TJ. It, it's it's blossoming like right yeah. now, I think. It's not the drunk kids anymore. Mm -hmm. There's this art and music and culture thing. And, and we're a bigger city when you put the two together yeah. than pretty much we anywhere. We at the hideout and we met Priscilla and everything clicked. And now we're playing at the Casbah, which is one of my favorite venues. I've been there like, a bunch of times and now we're playing there. Now we're here doing this interview. It's, it's, no, it's real for us. It's an open invitation as well for bands if they're listening. If they're going to come down to, D, to TJ, because we book bands over there sure. as well. So we produce events over there. But sometimes bands from over here don't know even where to play there or if there's something secure as far as their you know their equipment or all that. So if they want to send us a message, if they want to hook up a show yeah, over there, reach out. Can send us a message as well through Facebook. Okay. And we'll hook them up. Do it. Glassmus.com, G-L-A-S-M-U-S. Go see him on Sunday at the Casbah. Thank you, guys. Thank you, Priscilla. Thank you. Go to the hideout, too, as well. Always. Yeah, Great spot. It's only been the one venue in San Diego to change more names than <laughs> any other place. <laughs> We've heard. Mm -hmm. Brick by Brick is open again, and it's still the Brick what? by Brick. But uh, let's see. How many? Zombie Lounge, The Void. Uh, I went Zombie... <laughs> Uh, radio room. Yes. Which was pretty short. Yep, it's funny. The hideout's going to be there forever and co uh, compliment those people on making it look so nice. Definitely. Yeah. All right, you guys, have a great night. Thank Tra you very much. Travel safely back to TJ, my friends. Awesome. We'll yeah, do. We Thank, will. You. Thank you. And you got a t shirt for me there? Yeah. yeah it's really awesome. Good. We'll be back with Stay Strange. Sam Lopez is here. He's got a whole crew. There's an event going on at the Public Library downtown. If you like strange and experimental music, you're really going to want to listen to the next half hour. It's Local 94.9. He's in the back of your eyes He's planning a big surprise